this is the Aikawa home roasting system, um, which was kindly sent out to me on loan from Aikawa. Um, today I'm going to be doing a quick roast using one of their own coffees um, that you can buy from Aikawa. So this is a wash process coffee from Colombia. Um, you can buy this coffee directly from Aikawa as part of the home roasting system. So to get started with this coffee, you open the Aikawa app and then you add the coffee by scanning this barcode here. So you scan this and it adds the coffee directly into your roasting app. So you can add this coffee to your collection. At which point you can view the recipes for the coffee. So the recommended espresso profile, which is what I want to roast this coffee for today, is provided here, which is a medium roast. Um, you have some customizability of this, which allows you to change the roast degree to suit what you're after. You can also change the development time. Um, there's a lot of information within the app here, which shows you and informs you on what all that does. And then you can also use a graph editor to plot your own um, recipe from scratch, if you'd like. Um, I won't do that right now. So I want to use the, the standard medium roast as is provided. Medium roast, all I need to do is hit send to roaster. And that sends the recipe straight over to the roaster. Um, so now we just need to weigh out our green coffee and we'll be ready to do a quick roast. All right, so I'm gonna weigh my green coffee into here. So our green coffee here. So I'm gonna weigh it into this, which is one of the jars provided from my car. Use This is what collects your chaff and also collects the roasted beans once you've, once you've finished. But I'm gonna weigh 100 grams, which is the max capacity um, of the roaster. About 100 grams of green coffee. There. See that there? It's 100 grams of green. As you can see, our hopper is closed at the minute, so that's the open position. That's closed. It will tell you in the app if you've left it open and warn you to close it. Um, the doser. So yeah, I'm going to close the doser. You know, just tip that straight in there. such and then I'm going to twist it which will release the green coffee into this chamber here um, so let's do that now so that's the first step so we're going to turn this and it, oh, satisfyingly all the beans are just going to drop in like such I'm going to close it again there they are that's all our green coffee now that our green beans are loaded we're going to place a jar with this with the lid on. Under here, this is going to collect the chaff during the roasting process. And now we're ready to go. So the only thing that we need to do to start off the roasting is just press go. So now we can see the roaster is preheated. It preheated pretty quick because I've already done a roast uh, not so long ago. So now the coffee is spinning in this roast chamber here. So we've got a full overview here. The expected outcomes of this roast. And it couldn't be easier. Let's get back to watching this.
that are ramping up now and trying to get everything cooled down now that the roast is done. You can see in the graph the temperatures are plummeting as it cools the roaster right down. Just waiting for this to finish cooling down now and then we're going to remove the shaft and eject the beans from the roaster. Just watching the temperatures finish coming down. When it's done, the machine's going to tell us that we need to swap the jars over. We're going to put in a second jar. Uh, this is going to go in here. And that's going to collect the roasted coffee. It's going to fire. Oh, it's going to blow air really quickly through the roast chamber, which will blow all the beans out into here. All right. So yeah, now it's time to swap the jars. We're going to take all the chaff out. You can see how much shaft we've collected on this row. Yeah. Now that the roast is finished, I'm just going to press this button here and all the beans are going to be ejected. Perfect. As you can see, it ejected all the beans from the roaster. There's none left in the chamber. There we go. Freshly roasted coffee at home. There's our roasted coffee. This is uh, Wash Colombian using the provided medium espresso profile in the Akawa Home app. Now we have some freshly roasted coffee. Um, this is probably too fresh to drink right now, so I might let, I'm going to let this rest a few days before I brew this on espresso. But it smells amazing. I'm going to tip the fresh roast coffee into this vacuum jar just to keep it airtight. And you can do as many batches back to back as you'd like. So I could roast another 200 grams, have a full 300 grams. But for today, I'm just going to keep this uh, 100 grams here, uh, which you can just about see there. As you can see, I'm just going to keep this coffee in here, let it rest a little bit and I'm going to brew this on espresso, see what I think and then if I think it's not to my liking you can adjust the roast level, you can adjust lots of other variables to tweak the coffee to taste just how you want it to and that's super easy from the Akawa Home app and it saves all your roasts for you so you can see your previous roast but yeah that's pretty much it for the introduction to the Akawa Home coffee roasting system, um, it works really well. Um, so again, this was sent to me um, on loan to look at from Aikawa directly. If you use my affiliate link, you'll get 100 Aikawa store credits. So you'll be able to use these credits to buy green coffee, buy accessories, um, buy coffee that works seamlessly with the Aikawa home roasting system. So It'll be a QR code that you scan, there'll be a recipe there, um, different tweaks you can do. They've got some really interesting coffees on there, they've got geishas, they've got different mixed uh, packs from different origins. You do receive a welcome pack when you buy your own roaster, so you'll receive the five coffees um, in your welcome pack which do work seamlessly with this, with the home roasting system. So yeah, using my affiliate link will, will get you a, a hundred Aikawa credits when you buy a home roasting system. Otherwise, so far, my first impressions of the, of the roast system are really positive, super easy to use. As someone who's not really into, been into roasting previously, it's really approachable. Um, having the app, you get like a really easy to use interface, which makes roasting a batch of coffee super simple. Um, it literally walks you through it in the app so you can't even forget there's not really much of a learning curve. There'll be more content coming soon on this but I just wanted to share a quick roast, uh, roasting some coffees. Look forward to hearing your thoughts in the comments below and uh, yeah thank you for watching.